Okay, the mission today is abseil down to this really cool cave and camp in it tonight. Rope is in, gear's in the backpack, along with some frozen water bottles and a whole heap of burley, which is just weighing me down like nothing else. So let's get down there and um, start fishing. Can't wait. So much gear on my back. Now normally you wouldn't put a big haul bag on your back going abseiling. You would dangle it off your harness, but this section isn't steep. And then the final bit is, and I just put up with it. This little bit is a workout. And we go down horizontal and oh, oh. Try not to snap the rod. I'm taking this damn thing off. Cannot wait to get that backpack off. It was a mission getting out here. Oh, it's even a bit of firewood wedged up there for me. And I did have a fire here last time about there and nothing's left of it. And I plan to sleep in my hammock tonight. And I'm now looking to see how that's gonna happen. We will find out. Let's try and put a little directional in up here somewhere. Should do it. Yeah, that'll do. We're all ready to fish. I put Burley in the water. I'm just going to chuck the heavy outfit initially, which is a PE8 Progressive Rod by Ocean's Legacy, 100 pound Taz line on the reel. And we have a two ounce cheek head that we're going to launch in there. If I get nothing on that, I'll be going bait. I caught a couple of squid last night, so we've got plenty of bait. I want these boots off actually. They're annoying me. This is my setup, by the way. Fishing gear and all that to the side. Probably going to string my hammock there. Camera's hopefully not going to get knocked by my rope. That's the idea, having it tucked away there. And let's go have a cast. Um, rope management is always a bit of fun. Set that drag. Burley is just, oh, there's a fish. What is that? Probably a buff rim. Wouldn't surprise me. Um, what is that? Yeah, I think it's a buffy. Burley is just around the corner there, it's pilchards and it's going out pretty fast because it is super turbulent in here. But let's see how we go. All right, last cast, then we're going to go some bait. Right, I'm gonna make a bait rig. Made a bait rig for the heavy, ready to cast out, had bait prep, and now I looked down and there were herring everywhere. And they thinned, oh, they haven't really thinned much. So anyway, I got the light outfit ready, I had to put a new leader on it. And we're gonna cast this little guy and catch a few herring, because I'd like to catch something. And they make great bait. Not too bad on the chew. And um, I won't get black hands handling them, which is nice. That was a terrible cast first up. Look at them all coming. Yep, I'm on. See if it stays on while I winch it up. One herring. Caught my first fish. Just like that. We'll just catch a couple more and then I'm gonna go bait on the heavy. Let's just pull this in. I think I got like something small on, let's see. Probably a rat, but hopefully it's a brake seat cord or something better would be nice. A little bit of weight to it. What do we got? Yeah, it's a rat. That's all right. Hopefully there's like a big fat harlequin or brake seat or something nice down there that's hungry. a whole 
Kaiser, almost. Oh yeah, that was better. That's a bigger fish. Oh, far out. Yes. Oh crap, that is a big fish. Oh, I feel rocks. Oh no. I want him to come back. I feel rock. No, 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 no. It's a Sambo or a King. Come on. I think I've got him out from it. Yes. Gee. Just came along and slammed it. What do we got? I'd love it if it was a snapper or something different, but it feels like a Sam, looks like a Sam, yeah. Sambo. How beat have we got him? I cannot winch him. He's definitely a cliff gaff job. Good thing about Sambos is that once they're done, they tend to be done. I've got him. So, so we back that drag right off is normally my technique. Oh. And try and wind in some of the slack as I go. Oh. This is dinner. Yes. Not a monster. Oh, but a decent sized sambo. Put that there. I'll quickly dispatch him. We caught a nice sized Samson fish they are called. Um, part of the Seriola family. It's only a small one this one as well. They get absolutely huge. My PB is um, probably around the 40 kilo mark and they, they get bigger again. So I've already dispatched him. I'm going to bleed him out or her and uh, put her to the side. See if we can get something else. And failing that, we got a big slab of Sambo for dinner. What do we got? Oh, this is all right. Feels all right. Hopefully a big break cut or something. Big skippy. It's really shaking its head around a bit. It's, what is it? Oh, do we want to try eat him? I don't, oh, whoa, all right, we won't be trying to eat him. Good hooks. That was a Western Rock Blackfish, and the hook popped right there, but well, that's all right. You can eat him, but um, I don't really rate him. I think a sweep, I reckon a sweep's got better looking flesh. All right, I'm going to fill up the Samson fish now, and then I'm going to head up and get a bit of firewood ready for tonight and um, doing it while it's reasonably fresh is probably better and then I can get it into the cooler bag there we go that is just one fillet so much meat didn't even I probably cut a little bit of extra off the belly this belly fat bit looks good get that off My loins. Alright, I've got the fish in the cooler bag. I'm gonna run up the top with the backpack and get some firewood, a couple of rocks so I can have a nice little fire pit down here. So I'll be back in a second. I'm back. As you can see. With a load of firewood.
All right, fire is ready to go when I want it. I might do a quick test uh, with my hammock and then we'll keep fishing. This right here is what I'm sleeping in tonight. Just a hammock. Um, I just need to find a spot that's kind of has me horizontal and spread out enough between cams. Slightly scary. This is the crappiest one. Probably back that one up with another one up there if I can find one for it. This is all mozzie net that I'll pull up after. Mate, that is perfection. I'm gonna sleep so good in there. That is only one can there though. I got a little blue one up there that I'll use. Back into the fishing for a while, I reckon. What's that? Something really just came and grabbed it. I was just sitting there thinking, gee, it's going very quiet. What do we got? Oh, it's a weirer. I don't like these fish. These things are a pest. They're terrible eating. It's quite spiky. And he's gone back in. He's about eight meters to the water, by the way. And he seems to have swam down all right. That's good. Getting cold. The sun's been off me for a little while now. All right. I think I want a fire going. I'm cold. And I'm hungry. Cold and hungry, get me a fire. It is cold. Probably done. We'll move that. Let's see. Give this a quick boasting. Oh, hole is stuck to it. Bit of salad. A little bit of fish. I'll cook some more soon. I'll have a look at that. Oh, beautiful. See the QB. 
All right, got my dinner. Tastes really good. And a very smoky fire right there. But um, I'll try to get it not so smoky and I'm gonna have a cast again soon. I'm just kicking back for a little while. Not much happening on the fishing side of things, but that is this for a spot. Mate. This is quite comfortable. Last time I slept in a hammock on the side of the cliff, it was not very comfortable. But this is a good one. We'll do a little bit more fishing in a little while. Um, I might wait until it gets dark and then chuck a line in or something. Probably going to chill for a while. Woke up. I'm just gonna lay here and chill for a little bit and then I'll get up and start fishing soon. I slept pretty well. I was warm. This thing behind me kept me warm. It kept me pretty mozzy free. But it'd be very nice to have an under quilt under this thing so I don't have to move this thing around. Alright, we'll load that in. We'll see what happens. Not sure how long I'll hang around for. See if we can catch something this morning and then we'll probably pack up and head. I'm spewing off we got my underwater camera that I dropped in. I would have loved to have had a look down there and see what it looks like. Alright, I'm done. I'm ready to go. No fish. None that are hungry this morning anyway. I don't think I've lost the bait properly at all this morning. They've just a few picks and that's it. Very quiet this morning, no fish. A couple of little bites, I think just a little wrasse or something. So I'm gonna pack up, camp behind me and fall out of here. We are ready. Baggy tied on sitting there. Chucking a sender on. This just creates a little two to one sort of system for me. Bit of the old hip thrusting to get you up there. And once I'm at this little spot just here. That's a nice view. So yeah, once I'm just here, I'm gonna haul the bag up there and sit it there. And then I'll drag it the next bit. Let's try that. It's not that bad. It's not as heavy as I've had before. So let's just back a bit of this fella off so that I can actually get it on my back. Make sure it's locked though. All right. Oh, there we go. Oh, that was not good. All right, we made it. We're at the top of the cliff. Got all the rope sitting on here, backpack there, rods and that behind me. So I'm just gonna tidy things up and hike out of here. Other than that, thanks for watching and see you on the next adventure. Cheers.